is a replacement for the ASUS cable, boring cable. So I'm gonna open up and see if anything broken, especially the circuitry. Sure, but I think yeah, I'm gonna open up and see if it's broken. Looks good. And this is the charging port. When I open this package, I think something is sticking out here. So I'm not sure if it is normal. So this package is sticking out. It's like a spring. Huh? We're gonna put it into the mobile phone and see what happens. I bought online to DIY my own LCD screens and battery for ZZ 551KL Zenfone mobile phone and I'm really not sure what's inside but uh, let's, let's just open up and see. The packaging I have to clean because uh, this all come from China. We don't want uh, the viruses to spread inside this uh, area. The gate is clean. Pretty wonderful for you to open up the mobile phone. Now if you're going to buy this yourself, it's going to cost like uh, one to four dollars and uh, not including the shipping fees. Uh, we will see what it says. Okay, this is a C P one six zero six C five five one K L. When buying a, a battery, I'm not particular about the date. So it says here, if you can see, it's two zero two one January eighteen, which is quite latest uh, one year ago. So this is acceptable. It's still acceptable, and have to really use it. If not, battery chemical will expire, and it will discharge very quickly if it's expired. Uh, I like this packaging. Sometimes I come across a company that does this. Nah, what is this? Ah, okay, this is another screen. This, oh, oh my goodness, <laughs> I have another set of tools. Wow, in total I have three sets. Oh my goodness, wow. <laughs> oh yeah. Okay, this is ZZ551, yeah, 551. This is Zenbone 3 Laser 5.5. This model is quite old. Uh, Zenbone 3 and now Zenbone 6 already. Oh my goodness, it has a cable here, you see? It has a cable for volume and power and I stupidly I go and buy a new one because I was asking the guy if it comes with this uh, he didn't reply me so I spent another extra about This is the TPU cases for the phone ZZ perfect phone cable Look at the cracked screen When you drop onto the ground full of stone that is what happened and it breaks The only protecting rubber I have is this cover it's very difficult to find the uh, battery, so you gotta buy this online. And this is the battery. And I have to replace the uh, screen, so I got another parts which is from online to replace only the screen with the frame. Just need to let you have a look. Each LCD and touch screen have been tested. This kind of hex screw. It's quite tiny. You look at my fingernail and this size. And you look at the hex screwdriver. It is so tiny. And you just, your eyes, you need, really need to have a microscope. Because your eyes, you just can't see if you will ever go in and unscrew it. Because all you do is actually glazing on the surface. And it's so difficult to open. I have a problem opening this. Uh, so difficult. And you know why? I, I, I managed to open this and uh, this is a bit stuck. If I'm not able to open it, it will be very difficult for me to change the screen. Now, here it is. So tiny. Look at that. That's a lot of problem. Give me a lot of problem. So when you're changing a new handset, uh, LCD screen, do not screw too tight. Otherwise, you get into a trouble. See the time. That's the time how long it takes for me to remove the screw. <laughs> just too many screwdrivers. You just don't know which one will work for you. So it's best to mark it. Screws here as the same position here. You can screw back the hole using the same screw.
so I can't open it. Can you see that? It's my hot glue. I don't know why they put. Oh, huh? Oh, so hot. Smoke just uh, up here. I don't know why. Now it's not moving. See that? It's very bad. They use this kind of tape. I really need to open this. In the new frame, you only have this cable, which is this one. But you need this. Can you see? And it's not here. And this is a stupid. This is a stupid glue that I should not open and stick my battery onto the new frame because I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to put it on top of it. Because the, all I want is this uh, cable hook. Yeah, uh, finally. Look at that burn thing. See, it's charcoal. I hope this cable is working. Oh shit, that just broken. Uh? Unbelievable. Oh, beautiful. It's actually charging. Ah, oh, 
and press the touch screen. Yeah, gotta press it up. Yeah, I'm not sure again. <laughs> Problem is that uh, it's not responsive to my touch. I believe the touch trigger is strong, but the rest of it is good. At the back here, at the back here, if I touch it, it's working. See, that's actually working, and uh, the buttons is working. Actually, I, I did a I, I did a boot loader, and uh, the touch is working now. <laughs> yeah, wonderful. See, 